Newcomers Prime here, so it is time to react to Star Wars Age of Republic Anakin Skywalker by Star Wars Order Comics. So without further ado, for one on full screen, and let's go! Hmm. Very nice uh, picture of Anakin there. Love that intro as always. Hmm. Can't get enough of it. Hmm. Clone Wars theme. Even the largest army is nothing without a good general. Yep, true. The heroic Jedi Knights lead the clone armies of the Republic against the endless droid legions of the rebellious separatists. Ooh. The powerful young Jedi prodigy, Anakin Skywalker, may be the Republic's best hope to end the conflict. This feels like a Cornwall episode because of his Tom Kane narrator. It's a good impression of Tom Kane. Anakin faces challenges his training never prepared him for. Oh, yes. Call their sector. Thank you, General Skywalker. Anytime. Huh, Anakin. Let's finish this. Hmm. I think I can draw like he's going for like a Matt Lanter impression, I believe. Sounds a lot like Matt Lanter. We didn't expect to find a droid contingent of that magnitude in this sector. Do is we that Yolaren? Oh, it is Yolaren. Public intelligence located a previously unknown droid foundry on the third moon of Kudo. Wow. That's a very good Tom Kenji Lauren impression. Our window to destroy the foundry is limited. The nearest separatist reinforcements are less than two days away. So we strike quick and we strike hard. I've outlined a plan of attack based on our advanced scout reports. Why are the potential casualty numbers so high? It seems the foundry operations are being run by the local Kudon population. We suspect the droids were rushing into production before full automation of the facility could be completed. The last I'd heard, the Kudan hadn't chosen a site in the conflict. Intelligence says that's no longer the case. I recommend a surgical strike targeting the Foundry's generator. Our schematics are incomplete, but I believe it should fully destroy the facility. Killing everyone inside. Living beings, not droid soldiers. Unfortunately, the realities of war can be very ugly. Mm. We're lucky that the army we face is primarily droids. Yeah. A two-pronged attack would give us an opportunity to evacuate the Kadan. They aren't soldiers. They're workers. An emotional approach, but not a tactical one. Allowing time for an evacuation will allow time for the Separatists to raise defenses, which will mean far more risk of casualties to our own men. Either way, people will die. And it's our job to make sure it isn't our people. Mm. I wish I didn't understand Admiral Yularen's plan of attack. But I can't fault him for wanting to protect our soldiers. It's not like I'm wrong either. Yeah, it's a pretty decent impression of Atlanta, isn't it? it? Does in a war All of them are Anakin is a cause, Hayden Christensen. I'd rather just fly. I can definitely tell based on the artwork this is, this is like inspired by the Clone Wars. Obi-Wan, nice. Is it ever, Master? I heard about your discussion with Admiral That's Chris Yularen. Burns as Obi Wan. Let me guess. He wants the Jedi who questioned his order off his ship. No, actually, he may have his faults, but ego isn't one of them. He hmm. wanted to speak to me about your concerns. It sounds like Chris is doing an impression of Hugh McGregor again, wrong. doesn't it? The people in the foundry aren't soldiers, but if he's right about the risk to our clone soldiers, there has to be a better oh. way to approach this. Anakin's not after. Isn't that the whole reason the Jedi are a part of this war? To help save lives? Mm, I wish I had point. a simple answer for you, Anakin. But as we're all learning, war is very rarely simple. There mm. are even those on the side of the Republic who view clones as disposable. At least Admiral Yularen has far more respect for his men than that. Mm. I'm not saying Yularen's a bad soldier, or even a bad man. But from everything I learned studying with a Jedi, as your Padawan, slaughtering people like this is just wrong. You've come a long way, my former Padawan. 
Trust your feelings. Trust the force. Hmm. I don't think you, Lauren, was very happy with me. Hmm. So you prefer to listen to your emotions instead of an animal? I'm a Jedi. Nice echo effect. And I'm a Jedi first and foremost. Whatever military rank they give me. Hmm. We don't commit mass murder from a distance. Droid found on Codor 3. R2, can you jam their sensors? We don't want them to know we're coming. <laughs> R2 is always so helpful. You Lauren mentioned the local Kudan population. But I don't see any signs of civilization around here apart from the foundry. Is hmm. it just me? Or is this place too quiet, R2? Hmm, it's very suspicious. Even if this place was thrown together, the Separatists shouldn't have left it defenseless. I'm not saying you didn't do a good job blocking sensors, but there's something else going on here. Ooh. Stay with the ship and start plotting a course out of here. And I can always have the habit of leaving R2 behind on the ship, perfect. doesn't he? You know, R2's always got to protect the ship, hasn't he, Should when you think about it? Machinery. Maybe intelligence was wrong, and they haven't begun operations yet. No. There's something else. I can sense. Suffering? Oh. This way. No. Oh, battle droids. Those aren't workers. Better see, see my face, face is it any? What a oh You're free. Sharon as Kimi Skywalker. Love Sharon Gilmore's voice work. Hey, you aren't supposed to be here. That was a battle droid voice. Here I am. Too bad for you. The music played when he kills the sand people in Sacro Clones. And again in action, yes. Hmm. Rest the them. Jedi of the Republic. The ghast our village. We woke up here as prisoners. They told us the Republic was coming to kill us. So that's why we were afraid of him. Then we'll just have to alter their plans. Grab the blasters from those fallen droids. Assuming you know how to use them. Well, just because we don't fight in your war doesn't mean we can't fight. <laughs> I'm not asking you to fight in any war. Just for yourself. It seems that it was a trap laid by the Separatists all along. Leak rumors of a new droid foundry. An easy target for the Republic. Make sure the word got to our intelligence. So that we would attack a facility full of innocent victims. The Separatists would have blamed the Republic for their deaths. A very effective means of recruiting currently neutral worlds to their cause. All those lives would have been lost. Just so the galaxy would see Republic forces attacking a neutral party. A tragedy we avoided thanks to you. Mm. As skeptical as I may have been about your approach to this battle, it does appear to have been the right play. Mm. Do you think this will sway the Kudan to join the Republic? At the very well, least, I was speak I don't see them you are separatists now. Perhaps that's a discussion for the politicians. But because of you, Anakin, they're still here to make that choice. Oh. It says beyond me. Oh wow, that was absolutely spectacular. I really love this dub. It's definitely one of the best ones I've ever seen. I loved it. And the entire voice cast was spectacular and perfect as always, really was. I was very impressed with the voice work, how especially how we sounded so close to the Clone Wars act as well, apart from Chris Burton because he was doing an impression of Hugh McGregor, not James Arnold Taylor. Um but yeah, everyone was so good. I loved it, and the sound effects were great as well, and the music choices, it was really amazing, I love it, it's definitely one of the best ones I've seen. So, this me right to two stars, Age Republic, Anakin Skywalker, so yeah, you know, drill guys, uh, be sure to give this video a like, also be sure to leave us all in the comments uh, what you thought of this order drawn by stars, order comics, also be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos coming in the future, and I'll see you all later.